Greetings, this is Spec Ops 56 and my faithful Indian companion John Toe coming to you from Beer Tasting Central. And as the Geist would say, it's time to drink a beer. So today we're going to be reviewing our second homebrew beer. That's right, this one we brewed ourselves. And this one I'm not going to show you a close-up of this label because, once again, they print it off-center and it looks like crap. So, instead, I will insert a picture of what the label is supposed to look like right about here. Okay, this is our orange cream ale. We have named Orange You Glad It's Ale. Yes, yes I am. Now, <clears throat> let's give this a pour. Oh, before I do, this is for you guys, so I can be professional like you. Here's the cap. This is our summer beard cap. Okay, let's open this. This one we didn't have any problems with carbonating or anything else. We learned our lesson from the first one. Let's take a look here. Yes. We have carbonation, but it dissipates quickly. tasting here. But uh, first, yeah I've got to do something about head retention. Um, I've been talking to JP and he's got some some ideas so I think in our next homebrew I'll, um, I'll pay some attention to putting an addition in here that will help with the head retention. But we have good carbonation and we have a very nice nice golden kind of a gold kind of a uh, I guess you'd call it a orangish bronzish right golden uh, color it's got good carbonation we have plenty of carbonation now this I intended as our summer beer and uh, the alcohol by volume on this one once again, came out higher than I expected, uh, but you can't really taste it. And yes, I'm going to admit that we've already tasted our, our, this homebrew, but uh, we're going to pretend that we didn't for this review. Uh, it's 8.9% according to the readings. So let's have a taste and Tell me what you smell. It's oranges straight off the bat. Smell the oranges. Like I said, this is supposed to be an orange cream ale. And I will, I will say that it, it turned out pretty much just like I had intended. Now, it's not as strong an orange smell as it was when we first bottled it. Uh, at that time, when we, when we smelled it, it smelled like you just cut open a, a fresh orange. The orange smell has gotten much more subtle uh, since then, since it's bottle aged. Let's give it a shot. You bet. Mm. Mm, yep. Got orange. Got very light hoppiness. Just very, very light. light. Just very light touch of bitterness. Uh, floral, citrusy, hoppiness. 
It's sweet, but not overly sweet. It's a very light tasting beer. <clears throat> it's, it's exactly the kind of beer that you would want uh, just to enjoy in the summer after you mowed the lawn or whatever. Uh, at least that's what I think. What I do you agree think? too, yeah. That if you're doing grilling outside, this would be a plus to go with it. And it really is strange that it's that high in alcohol volume, but you cannot taste the alcohol no. at all. It is really a good beer. It's very smooth. And I'm not very, prejudiced either. <laughs> yeah, very drinkable. Really got the nice, nice orange flavor to it. When I took some down to JP at the brew house, and he tasted it. It hadn't, it hadn't fully aged yet, but uh, he said he thought it tasted like orange soda. <laughs> I don't think it's quite, <laughs> quite like orange soda. But it is a very light, very smooth, very tasty beer. I'm very proud of this one. I really am because this this came out exactly the way I envisioned it when I made it. So um, tell me what you got. What else you got to say about it? Well, I, I enjoy it. It's very good beer. Were you uh, expecting it to come out like this? No, I wasn't. It was quite surprising. It turned out very well. And other people that have tried it, I haven't found anyone yet that didn't like it. Yeah, we've had several people try it at the beer tasting over at the <coughs> brew house. Uh, you know, JP holds once a month, and everybody that tried it said that they thought it was very good. So um, I don't know how, but we we seem to be getting it right, <laughs> even when we think we're about to get it wrong. All right, it turned out very well. So. All thing I got left to say about this is, uh, guys, be on the lookout for a package that will be winging its way towards you soon. And I can't wait to see how you're going to review this one. Yeah, it's going to be interesting. So, till the next time, cheers, everybody. Got it right. Do my stuff. I Go know. do your thing. All right. And I'm going to finish this. I'm not letting this go to waste. It's like I picked the wrong week to quit drinking.